Okay, I'm back. I found my scissors. <laughs> Couldn't find them. Um, but anywho, I'm almost done. So now I'm going to take this $3 ribbon. And God only knows, I have no clue how much it would cost. I mean, I love Hobby Lobby and Michaels and all that kind of stuff, but I don't go in there very often. I mean, it's not, not as much as I'd like to because, you know, it's so expensive, even when their prices are on clearance. I mean, it's crazy. I don't get that much money. So, okay, so here I go. I'm going to go ahead and take this right here. Let me show you. You see this piece right here? Can you see this piece right here? This is the ending piece. This is like a piece that's kind of started. I'm going to glue that down. Okay, reinforce it a little bit. One of the things I noticed that hot glue gun from the Dollar Tree, one of them little tiny glue guns like this, they don't get that that hot. They get hot enough to melt. But I got a, I got so many glue guns at home, them things will burn your skin off if you're not careful. Okay, so anywho, so if you want to, you know, if you're really thorough. You can go and look along the edges and make sure that, like I found a couple pieces here, uh, or a section here that's needs to be reinforced. Whoa, ouch. Okay, reinforce that a little bit. There you go. This is the poor man style, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. My other personality is coming out today. My muse personality, okay? I swear I got different personalities, but anyway. So I'm just kind of going along the edge here where this piping is. You see the piping? This black, black piping right here. I'm making sure that everything's kind of secure. You know, if I kind of pull on the, the ribbon a little bit and I see that there's a little bit of a gap there, you know, it's not a big deal. I'm just going to take that hot glue gun and I'm going to fill that little, whoops, look, look, see, that's what I'm talking about right here. See, okay. I'm going to fix that. Evidently that's a piece that I missed or a section that I missed. Okay. I'll fix that. Reinforce it. You know, they got a different color glue gun or not glue gun, but glue, um, sticks gold and silver and glittery and you know all kinds of different colors if you felt like you wanted to use something that corresponded with what you're working with okay so i'm going around the edges right now to see if there's any loose areas that need to be you know just kind of reinforced a little bit a little dab of glue here and a little dab of glue there but it kind of looks like i've got uh, I think I got most of it. I mean, you know, it doesn't look tacky or anything. Okay, I think it's good. I think it's good. So, this is going to go on the very top of her footstool. It's a footstool. It's got this, this uh, pattern on it. And then I added the embellishment of... The three dollar thrift store ribbon, okay? Doesn't have to be perfect because it's not like somebody's going to go up to it and you know use a magnifying glass and try to determine if you did a really good job. Um, it does have a few little pills on the material, which I think I could take a razor blade and kind of smooth over that. But the reason I think the pills are there is she had put something on it, my granddaughter, and it had a little bit of a stain. So I used just regular soap, body soap with a sponge and just kind of manipulated that area. And then I rinsed it the best I could, you know, and just kind of touched it up so it would be nice and clean. So there you go. Three dollar bolt from the thrift store. All right, got lucky. It's got the wire in it. Got my little pair of scissors here and my little hot glue gun. 
and my little item that I'm working on, and that's it. It's a done deal, ladies and gentlemen. I think she'll like it. Thank you for watching. Bye.